welcome to the first episode of the BHS Bottom Line. My name is Isabel Carey. And I'm Nick Latanzi. Just mentioning the play Hamlet often elicits groans, even from those who have never read it. Yet Belmont High School's Performing Arts Club had audiences laughing out loud with their production of The Complete Works of William Shakespeare Abridged earlier this month. And who could blame them? Under the careful instruction of new theater director Liz Smith, the cast willingly made fools of themselves, performing Romeo and Juliet in drag, rapping, and wearing anatomically incorrect costumes. For three nights, the Complete Works troupe performed for a sizable and receptive audience. The positive audience reviews of the play have set the tone for what many are calling a new and successful era of theater at BHS. Last week, Massachusetts voters elected Deval Patrick governor. Democrats also swept on a national level, gaining control of the U.S. House of Representatives and the U.S. Senate. On a local level, William Brownsberger won his bid for state representative against Republican Libby Ferenzi. At the high school, although only a handful of students voted, the majority were pleased with the results. Roving reporter Danny Selgrade investigated. I'm glad that the Democrats won because I live in Massachusetts. Well, it really shows that, that Iraq has ultimately been Bush's downfall, both like in terms of actually going in there and in its poor execution. Um, I thought that the election this year was really great because we got the first woman speaker of the House in 217 years and she's a Democrat from California and she's done various things in both the state of California and in the nation. Um, he is in support of windmills. He was the only Democratic candidate that was and so I was great. it was great. He won the primary and he swept the election and um, hopefully we'll be seeing windmills in Cape Cod. We would love to have your feedback on our first show. If you have any questions, story ideas, or comments, send us an email. BHS bottom line at gmail.com. I'm Isabel Carey. We'll see you next time. I'm Nick Latanzi, and that's the bottom line.